It's the latest attraction in the port of Hamburg. The river bus on its test drive through Hafen City. Until now, the new Hafen City river bus was just a vision, but today it's an action. Come on and join us, we are on board. The journey begins in Entenwerder, just behind the Nordelbrücken. It's taken four years from conception to where we are today. It's a new product and a new vehicle. And we had to look at all the problems, all the risks. It was a long process for everyone involved. We did it in cooperation with the Hamburg Port Authority and it worked out well in the end. The amphibious bus can transport up to 36 passengers and three crew members. The vehicle is a one-of-a-kind and was developed specifically for use in the port of Hamburg. On land it's a relatively normal bus. It has a chassis upon which the vehicle is built. But of course it has to be sealed off to create a rump. After all, it has to float on something. And the interesting question is, are you a bus driver or the captain of a ship, or both at the same time? I'm both. If I get stopped on the street, then I have to show my credentials as a bus driver. If I get pulled over on the water, I have to prove that I have the appropriate nautical paperwork. So I have to do both. That's one of the most complicated things with this bus, finding drivers. They're few and far between. When it goes into service, the bus will ply a route from Entenwerder to Hafen City. Hamburg Port Authority granted a license to the operators in March. It wasn't an easy decision. We negotiated with the operator for a long time. There are special regulations for commercial vessels in Hamburg, so anybody charging to transport people. That's why we took a close look at the vehicle. We commissioned surveys, and the result was yes, the vehicle conforms with regulations. But it should only be used in areas where traffic is restricted. We agreed with that, which is why the river bus will now be able to ply its trade here in the eastern part of the port, where the waters are calmer and it won't be bothered by the wake of large ships. The bus cruise on the Elbe takes a good half an hour, and then it's time to go back to Entenwerder. The official start of the swimming bus will be in the middle of April. Thanks for watching us, see you next time, and as we say in Hamburg, tschüss!